my name is ashish ashish agarwal and i'll be delivering this lecture to you so before commencing the session just a quick round of update regarding my youtube channel which is youtube.com slash ashish agarwal underscore gg so if you haven't visited the channel i would request you to do visit the channel and do like share and subscribe the channel the channel is dedicated to golden gate related thank you now there are two examples in front of you okay go through them and tell me can anyone identify what is the difference between second and third anyone so those are filter clause but one is using built in function another one is not using built in function so what is the difference between the second filter statement and third filter statement can anyone tell me so guys greater yeah, than zero means it's true greater than zero means one it means it is true yeah some uh, you were trying to speak yeah yeah third one is basically matching uh, exact match okay yeah so the second one is just the other way uh, what do you mean by other way ramesh yeah which is not matching right uh, because uh, zero is false uh, so if uh, the string find is false is uh, no not it's false. greater than zero greater yes, than zero means false. it's true so yeah. gre mm -hmm. greater than means one greater than zero means it's true yeah okay uh, anyone else What is the difference between second and third statement? Both are same. Okay. Try to look into it. You will identify. Uh, using the when we use the strings, it is always recommended to uh, use one of the filter clause. So I guess the first one is uh, mm, uh, first one is uh, applicable here. No, but what is the difference? Okay, that's fine. That when you're using string, when you're using, using uh, when you're working with string, it, it is recommended to use string functions. But that's fine. That is a recommendation. That is not like, but that is not the difference between them. Yeah, on a closer look, both looks to be same because in the second one, if we put name equals to Joe, string find will be true and uh, one is greater than zero. So that will process the Joe updates or inserts. Okay. Okay. I'll tell you. In the second okay. string, it is finding a string inside a string. So basically, in the second requirement, you can have let me open a notepad so in the second statement which is string find okay it is finding a string inside a string so basically it can have any prefix or suffix so it can have like say for example a a a j o e then b b b so it will find a string inside a string and if joe is find anywhere it will be true. However, in the third part, it is it will look for the exact string as Joe. So, if there is any prefix or suffix before it, it won't be exact match. So, in the third point, it is looking for an exact match. However, in the second string find function, it is trying to find a string inside a particular string so there can be any prefix or suffix so it is not looking for the exact match but it is just looking for a string inside a string. that is the difference between second and 